YouTube, welcome back to another vlog. It's bright and early today, 6.55. We are on the way to the train station as we've got a day in the office. So guys, that is the um, commute done. I'm now at the office space in Manchester, which I told you about the vlogs. I'm the only one here right now, it's 8.25. I'm still not quite sure what everyone does here, because obviously it's hot desking, and there is offices for other companies upstairs. There is a big initiative for tech startups here, which is why I've come here. Today I've got the social media manager who started yesterday coming in. I need to crack on with the Black Friday stuff. I think we also may run a promotion on the beginners course. So if you're interested in starting to make music, um, the link will be somewhere, actually, by the time this is out, now you're finished. And I need to write the email sequences for like onboarding and stuff. So all in all, quite a busy day. I've got my stuff if I want to train here. There is a gym here, but I've had to a rest day, really. I'm pretty sore today, I'll sleep that well. Sometimes it's due to not enough rest from the gym, so we'll see. Just to get some work. So folks, it is 10 past 12, it is lunchtime, and I walked to walk a favourite of mine. I ordered the Don Berry with chicken, grilled chicken, after a tiny bit of sauce, so it's hopefully reasonably low cow comes in egg on. This morning I have spent uh, with Sam who is managing the social medias, um, executing the plan. I really want to start posting on Twitter, LinkedIn, as well as YouTube Shorts, TikTok, Instagram, as you can imagine. That's a lot of posts we post every day, so an extra hand in that department, hopefully all is well. It's going to be a bit of a slow start, just trying to figure out how we're going to operate as we're making up as we go along. Everyone is a business, that's one thing we learn to start doing stuff like this. Uh, but yeah, then I'll go back this afternoon, finish off, some, finish off some emails, hopefully do a little workout session in the gym, which is in there, uh, in the office, and then head home this evening. Black Friday is going pretty well. We did a 25% discount on the beginner's course. We did a 10-part trial on the app. So if you want to try either, it might still be available when you watch this. But even if not, even if it's about full price, everything is worth it. The, uh, the fact we've nearly got three years into doing business is evidence of that. So beneath the office space there is a gym. I'm doing the first workout of my trial. I've got a week, it's only 30 quid a month. And it saves me to go to the gym near where I live. I think I've said before in a video that it's a bit of a ball lake, trying to train and then work. So if we get a good session here, we might be able to um, do all our gymming here, but you can, as you can see, the shower's now well clean. So, sit go. So, we're just doing a pretty basic workout. Did a bit of conditioning at the start, outside. Did some, um, I can't even think what, what I was doing. <laughs> uh, basically just making my heart rate go up. Did some uh, burpees, box jumps, all sorts. Now we're just doing a little arm pump because today was meant to be a rest day really. But we thought we'd get in anyway. The gym is super nice. However, it's quite dark and dingy, but it'll definitely do. Um, it's an extra 30 pound a month on my rent. I'm definitely considerate, but we'll see. Because obviously, if I don't come, it's still 30 quid. But I want to finish this off with just some triceps, some more arms, um, there are some abs, get a shower, and then head back to the homeland. YouTube, it's Friday, which means a brunch bar and some studio time. We just made a pretty sick video, and we do a little play for you, it might be a bit loud.
been a while since I made some videos in, um, inside Simpho, I've been super busy with the app. But today, I had some inspiration, so I decided to make a little jam. Maybe I'll play at Mint tomorrow if we can do a bit more. I want to go for a run. England are playing tonight. Life's good. Tomorrow's Mint, so it's a big one. Could we playing some records this evening. And yeah, this morning I didn't go to the gym. I've not been sleeping too well this week, so potentially it's because I didn't rest enough and maybe having caffeine too late. I, I only have caffeine like never past one, but having two coffees sometimes gets me a bit wired. So, yeah, not much to report today. Tomorrow's is a big one. So, if I do anything else exciting in a bit, I'll pull you in. I think today is going to be chilled, music, work. Yeah, I'm ready for the big one. Set up for recording. Just finished recording a track from scratch. Well, part two is recorded. The studio is now getting switched off. I'm going to be walking home shortly. Get some food on the way home. I'm going to have a nice, relaxing evening. Probably going to play some records, watch the football. And then tomorrow we go to war. folks it is saturday afternoon today's game day i am playing mint warehouse with trauma and ricardo villalobos mint is an institution that has shaped my musical taste massively i spent the ages of 18 to maybe 20 21 going there regularly i went to Leeds uni for a year many of you may not know and i was there every weekend we always went back and forth for the terrace parties so it's a club which I have so much respect for and also uh, have a lot of gratitude towards as I had uh, a chance to play at Mint Club in the early days and obviously now it's Mint Warehouse, sorry. So I've recently referred Mint Warehouse and Mint Club is now gone, but they've kind of turned Mint Warehouse into Mint Club, but bigger. And honestly, it's one of the best clubs in the world, I believe. So there in Sankey's are probably the two places which have shaped my musical taste the most. I saw the likes of Sonia Minera, Mint, Craig Richards, Paranoid London, seen Apollonia, Ricardo, whole host of names, Zip. So tonight's going to be special. We're getting a taxi down at about 8pm. We're going for some food at 7 before me and some friends. My friend Murray is actually videoing tonight. He's giving videography a go. He's got a camera. So he's going to try and shoot some bits. I'm going to get some bits in the vlog. And all in all, just have a good time and really take this one in. I'm playing before Trauma. Then Trauma is playing before Ricardo. So no pressure, folks. But... If I'm going to be honest, I've really got the bug for it again. Not that I never lost the bug, but there's times when I'm not completely dialed in with the weekend, there's little things going on. And despite this week being incredibly busy with the app, which has gone very well, by the way, so anyone that's joined, big respect. It's uh, been really, really great to see so many people feeling what we're pushing. So yeah, the, the app's gone great, but I'm equally as dialed in, if not more dialed in, to what we're doing tonight. I would say I'm probably more dialed in than, than the task at hand tonight than anything else. So... It's going to be a great, great occasion, one I'll never forget, and one I'm going to get absolutely stuck into. We are on the way to get some food. We have left the house. We're out for the night. It's 6.15. We're going to meet Tom Rollo and Seb. Tom Rollo is the guy that I mentioned last video who's going to be the future tour manager because Kurt's useless. Kurt's had a cold all week from one night out, so he's meeting us there from Manchester. We're going to get a nice steak, I believe. Probably some beers. I'm pretty nervous, but I'm pretty excited. Morris, who's currently driving, it's also on his debut filming. He's got a camera. He's going to be giving a videography a shot over the next few months and hopefully a few years. I'm sure we'll get some footage along the way, uh, on the way to the Leeds. I'm in it. Uh, yeah, and then one terabyte. Yeah, that's what I did. Oh, there you go. You've got to upgrade the fucking RAM, mate. Yeah, 16, 16 RAM, baby. Big RAM, baby. Terabyte hard drive. RAMI bottom, mate. These go shop, don't we, really? What are you getting from the shop? Uh, it's going to be 20 kilo standard. 20 now, big old to me, sir. I've downgraded to 20 now, nowadays. I'm on 40. You used to get 40 yards, Sab. So did I, to be fair. Alright, so we're at 20 from the shop. Let's take the camera in shop. <laughs> you want on YouTube, mate? Whoa. Yes, boss man, you're on YouTube, mate. <laughs> Can I get 20 miles for golds, please? Yes, yeah, lost. Is it a YouTube vlog, mate? <laughs> please, sir. 
Nice one, lad. What are you getting, Rollo? Roll these. He's going to get some more rollies. <laughs> I've never seen him run out of tobacco. He's always had tobacco no matter what. I was in a I was toying with the idea of a fucking set up. <laughs> in you go, son. <laughs> now then, now then. In the back of the... Uh, we actually upgraded to the premium. The guy in the front here is absolutely... Had a sock. I don't think he's on. You could say he's had our fucking pants down. Got told it was 132. What's it charge us, Bakes? 150. 150. It's got a red Bugatti at home. But... Possible refund on arrival. But, on a positive note, you can't see it from here. Leg room, 10 out of 10. It's better than turning up in the old uh, Yaris, anyway. <laughs> I'll give it that. Buzz has got his, uh, his new cam there as well. Absolute squad. Full tech team tonight. Buzz is road testing his, uh, his camera skills, so... Yeah, we're looking forward to it. Biggie. Well, we never stopped this close. We always stopped earlier. Yeah, I know. We've done pretty well, well right? Yeah, it's <laughs> <so> well. <laughs> to be fair, it's normally a 15-man bus, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> 